What's up everybody, 915 Mang here. I wanted to talk to you about my return pump that I'm using on the 150 SCA Aquarium Reef Tank. Now this pump, I got it from Marine Depot. It is a sun pole, it is a DC pump. I think that if you haven't messed with a DC pump, you should definitely check them out. Uh, I think they're all probably pretty good. Uh, but uh, this one right here is pretty awesome because uh, I haven't been having any problems with it and uh, believe it or not I'm only using it on the uh, lowest settings uh, now this pump right here has six selectable speeds you know and what I really liked what this is what I really liked about the uh, return pump is that it had a feed mode now I'm gonna show you that feed mode on the controller uh, my tank right now is being run without any type of controller just the uh, you know timers on the light the uh, feed mode button on the uh, pumps and also on a feed mode button on this uh, return pump I have been using this return pump since my tank has been up and uh, I gotta say it's pretty awesome it's pretty quiet and I think that's very important for anybody who has a reef tank that your uh, focus and attention should be strictly on your reef tank uh, and this pump right here will absolutely do that. Now, what I liked about it is that it had 21 feet of headroom, so I could shoot up to 21 feet. My tank is only like 6 feet, if that, on top. The controller is pretty awesome. It does have like a heat sink on the back. Like I said, I keep it on the lowest setting, uh, which is 1, but you can absolutely crank this up here if you want as you can see it is pushing water now I just hit that feed mode button that's why you're hearing all that siphon but you can go ahead and click it back on whenever you're done the reason you probably want to do the feed mode button is if you want to do some top-down shots you want to kill the flow in the tank or you want to target feed or something like that you maybe I have to do maintenance but if you do it's gonna stay off for 10 minutes and if you forget it's gonna go ahead and click on back on now I did want to talk about the quality of the pump the pump itself is a high quality as you can see I've never seen a controller like this with a heat sink on the back I did mention it early but these guys uh, took care of business right there everything is quiet the parts the impeller the impeller is pretty awesome it's hardcore and uh, on this one the uh, Magus which is the biggest pump that they have which is kind of funny I got the biggest pump that they had in case if I wanted to add a um, some reactors or a manifold or something like that but I'm only running it at the one speed I'm gonna go ahead and show you how quiet it is as you can see listen I uh, just want to do a quick review on this pump highly recommend it quality parts and uh, you guys take care and let me know what you guys are running